like six months since I've uploaded my last one, but this one is going to be about Rust, or specifically uh, how to enable SLI on this thing. Now, as you know, SLI has been broken on Rust for uh, basically as far as 2018 ended. Now, um, this is 2019 when I'm recording this, and uh, I'm using a new SLI profile that nobody has tried before in Rust. Now, this comes from a specific other game, which also uses, uh, I believe, a variation of the Unity engine. But um, it's called Senua's Sacrifice, uh, or Hellblade, as it's otherwise known. So, um, what I've done is applied it to the uh, Rust profile in NVIDIA Inspector, and I've gotten it to somehow magically work. And I've been playing this game for uh, over an hour on this profile without any crashes or any bugs whatsoever. Maybe a few like minor visual glitches, but turn everything to ultra low, really no one can see. You. Now these are my settings in game, as you can see everything is off. All of these as well. All of these. I mean I turn these up so I can see people with sniper rifles, but uh that's about it. And uh input Yada yada, audio is uh, stock standard. Options, yep, as you normally would, and my field of view is maxed out for uh, maximum uh, visibility against the Zergs. So, uh, yeah, I mean, it works. What can I say? Let's go check out this raid over here. Hello, my friends. I have some pipes for you. It's for free. I don't need anything. I'm just recording a video for YouTube right now. Get some more shit. I'll take it. Hello, friends. I give you free stuff. Come here. I have sheet metal. I'm coming to your door, please don't shoot. Alright, goodbye. And amazingly, I'm still alive. Maybe I said that too well. Don't worry, I have mushrooms. Mushrooms are an easy way to stay alive. Not like this. <laughs> ah, I could all rust. Don't do this to me! <laughs> I gave you free stuff! Why? <laughs> but yeah, I mean, as you can see, it's smooth and it's very stable. I'm running on a constant 60, 4 to 70. And um, this is on pretty potato resolution though, I gotta say. But as you can see, the SLI indicator bar is uh, nice and wide. Very, uh, very stretchy, yes. About uh, 30-40% utilization of my second uh, GTX 680. Well, after all, this is a 690 I'm running on. But, uh, yeah, I'll just take a sec to tab out as well and show you exactly how to do this in NVIDIA Inspector. Okay, so these are the settings that you require for uh, NVIDIA Inspector to get SLI working. So you go to your Rust profile or whatever directory it is. It needs to be at least 2.13 for NVIDIA Inspector, and I'll have the link in the description for which one to download. And, okay, so starting off, you need to set SLI compatibility bits here, 0, and then DX10 plus 11 to The Witcher 3. Make sure this, this is one of the most important ones to set. And uh, everything else here is your stock standard. I set mine to the highest refresh rate because I'm playing on a CRT. And, uh, whatever here, it's just stock standard stuff. You can increase the LOD bias to make a game run faster as well. And uh, over here, these are the important SLI settings. So you need to set SLI GPU count 2. And I just set that on because I'm recording. SLI rendering mode needs to be 0x something 2 for CFR. Not AFR2, mind you, but who knows? AFR2 might work, but uh, just go with AFR for now. After that, 
come down here and try to enable the unknown settings using the uh, button over here and all of these are just standard as well whisper mode standard okay now for these three settings these are the critical settings you need to enable this profile to work anything else it will not work the game will crash 10 minutes in okay so you need to set 0x676635 to 0 and then following that 0x00 a 06746 to this following over here which is uh, 0x00 and following that 0x00 a 0694b to the value of 0x0000 100a and uh, set this to the Battlefield 5 and ETC thing, which is 0x blah 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 4, and also down here to Monster Hunter Online if it wasn't set to that already. Now, these are the only settings you need. Nothing else, nothing super complicated. It's just those settings, and you plus apply changes, everything should work straight off the bat, yeah? And therefore, you have SLI once again, just to prove it for the billionth time. I do in fact have two uh, video cards here. I'm running a GTX 690, as you can soon see. Here and here. And uh, just for thought, we also have the driver version 417.35. This is confirmed working on that driver version alone. I'm not sure about the rest, but I'd assume they will work as well. Now, before I used to use a uh, Far Cry profiles, but that doesn't really work now. Alright, just timing back into the game. It's like a guy creeping up around here. As you can see, it's still running and it's very smooth on 70 FPS. And uh, this is on Upsurge as well. So uh, if you play, uh, maybe I'll see you on here sometime in a few months when everyone's back on school holidays and uni holidays. Uh, I have a couple of friends on a uh, semi zerg. I could just play on that. Oh, it's a good starter base actually. But yeah, I hope you've enjoyed the video and I hope you've found uh, SLI to be functional again after this. So, uh, best of luck. Try not to get raided instantly and I uh, hope your video card doesn't explode. Alright, this is it. Uh, can't be guy 1, 2, 3 out and see you next time. Make sure to drop a like or I will drop a rock on your head.